What's up guys? So I know you guys have been asking for this, so I got my phone in my hand. I'm gonna break down iMovie app for your phone. I'm gonna show you guys a couple different things you could do and um, explain it. So let me hit the record button here. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna open up iMovie in our, on our phone. And when you open it up on your phone, let's turn my phone sideways here, you're gonna see a big plus sign there. And what we do is we click on that big plus sign to start a new project. Now there's two different type of projects. You got your movie and you got your trailer. The one you're probably gonna to wanna to do is click on uh, is movie. Um, trailer, that kinda um, is a way for you to follow like a template and it creates like a Hollywood style video where the movie side, that's gonna help you take all your videos and combine them into one. So we'll go ahead and click on that. All right, so now we have our screen here, okay? And the first thing, you could select whatever you want here, and it'll show you a preview. If you wanna get access to the media, go ahead and click on the top left-hand corner, media, and you can select your clips. I'm gonna select these two clips. All you gotta do is tap on both of these. And at the bottom there, you're gonna see Create Movie. Go ahead and click on Create Movie. Now from here, it's gonna bring it up in our timeline. Now if we use our fingers and we extend this way and outwards, just like a phone, we extend outwards, it's gonna take the timeline, it's gonna stretch it out, it's gonna bring it back in. It's just like on any iPhone, we could adjust the, the timeline. Um, and if we want to take the first footage, for example, we wanna put it in front, we just hold on to it and drag it in front. That could rearrange our timeline. Um, we can also click on our timeline. And if we click on our timeline, we could adjust, let's say we want to take that out. There's a couple ways we could do that. We could take this slider and move it over like this. We can also take this and put it there, select our clip, make sure the scissors icon is selected and click split. And then we could actually just take that and just delete it. But let's just say we want we have this and we want this for the front. Now we move on to our second clip. We could adjust this as well. Um, maybe we want to stop it there or start it here. We'll start it right there. And that's how you do that. Okay, now if you notice, like when we select our clip, there's a couple of options in the bottom. You have your scissors, you have that. What that will do is speed up or slow down your film. So you can speed up and slow that down. And if you play it back, you see, it will speed up and slow it down. Okay, then you have your second option here, which is the volume. If you want to turn the volume up and down. Okay, we could also click on the first tab there with the scissors, and we could also click detach, and that will detach our audio from there. And then from there, we could select it and we could actually move it. We could remove it. We could shorten it. Okay, we could do all that. Let's see what else here. Okay, so on the bottom there, you have that. And then you have your T, which is the basically you could add uh, text on your image. And we also have that where if you want to adjust your, um, you want to put some type of filter on your, um, on your screen, you could do that as well. All right, so if we go on to um, see the next thing here. So we so we added that. Let's do this. Let's take this and um, let's put some text right about here. So we'll click on that image. We'll click on text. All we have to do is select that. And we could just type our text right in here. Or we could select the bottom one. It's, it's bigger font. Tasty. Now we have our text in there. Okay. So if you play this back, you'll see it has text. We slowed this down a little bit. And now if we want to, let's see. If we want to add music to this, all we need to do is click that little gear button on the, on the right side and it will show you um, a bunch of things you could do to add like theme music and whatnot. I think you could add your own songs on here as well. Um, 
But the first thing we want to do where it says theme music, click on the right side and click that icon button so that it's blue. And we can select one of our theme music. So now if we select this first one, and you'll notice we have a green bar there. And if we play it back, but the problem is, is we still have the audio on our first clip. So we'll, we'll select the first clip and what we'll do is we'll click detach and there's our audio. Now if we click on the speaker, we could lower that audio. And if we go to that, back to the first now, you'll see it's playing the audio we just added on there. Okay. So that is what you do. The last thing I think we want to discuss is the transition. So let's say, like, say we want to use a transition. We click on that little middle icon and we have a few different transitions we could use. Um, you could also change the duration of the transitions. So if you notice, if you click on it, hold on, what's going on? I'm stuck. Okay, on the left hand side, you'll see the duration 20. Uh, you could just choose one of those if you want it longer or or shorter and you got a bunch of different options you got dissolve slide wipe fade all you have to do is add those into the center there now let's just say i i use this right here i use a wipe if you notice we put it back it does a, a simple wipe okay um so those are all the things you can do with just the app and i use this basically anytime i'm out and I'm doing an open house, I just don't have time to, I wanna do something real quick, I would use something like this. Last step, all you have to do is click done and you could export your video just by clicking that little square button and you could either airdrop it to your computer or save it, whatever you like to do. That's pretty much in a nutshell how you do editing with an iPhone and a simple app called iMovie. Take care.